Hello and welcome to the online demonstration of Auto Number for Microsoft Dynamics CRM 2011, both on premise and online. Auto Number aims to provide a simple, no code solution to generate sequential references for any entity within Microsoft Dynamics CRM. Auto Number is deployed as a managed solution. When the managed solution is imported, you will see a gap consulting sub area appear within the settings area and within that you will see an interfaces entity and an auto number definition entity. The interfaces entity allows us to define things like the license key information and we can also turn on uh, tracing if any problems are encountered. Demonstrate auto number we shall set the scene by looking at a contact record. So if I open up an existing record, I will see that I've added a custom field called the contact reference. So I'll now create an auto number definition which will update the contact reference. So if I navigate to the settings area and then auto number definitions, I simply create a new record, I give it a name, so contact reference, then I simply select the entity. So within here we have the contact. So notice there's no need to know the schema names of any of the entities or the fields, it's simply point and click to select the entity and the fields to update. So if I scroll down to contact reference. After selecting the entity and field to update, we then need to define the starting number. So the next contact record that I create will get this uh, next number. So I shall say 100 thousand the increment value allows us to increment either in single uh, figures or maybe in tens or hundreds should we need to so I'll increment by one we can then optionally define a prefix and a suffix so my prefix I could say uh, let's say C hyphen we then get a preview of what the reference string where will look like and at that point all I need to do is save the record. Upon saving the record that will actually create a plugin in the background which will fire on create of the contact record. We also have the ability to reset the auto number to a previous value uh, should there be any uh, requirement to potentially start um, the, the reference at a previous value. So if I save and close that record I can see that I have got a single auto number definition available now and that's on the contact entity. I can create as many auto number definitions as I like uh, on any entity within the system. So to illustrate this in action now, if I go to sales, contacts, and create a new contact. Obviously before the contact record is actually created I must fill in the mandatory information. And then as soon as I save this record, I will see that the contact reference has been populated by the next value that we defined in our auto number definition. For more information you can contact us on solutions at gapconsulting.co.uk, call us on the number provided or to download a trial version of Auto Number, go to www.gapconsulting.co.uk 
Alternatively, you can download it from pinpoint.microsoft.com.